you're spending time at the wonderful world of Dollywood in Pigeon Forge, Tennessee, there's a certain mystique involved in boarding a means of travel that was so prominent to the area way back in the old days. Cutting through the beauty of the Smokies on Dolly's well-known coal-burning steel locomotive, known as the Dollywood Express, is something everyone should enjoy during a visit here. Sarah and I were excited to finally ride it, and we wanted to get the full experience, starting from the train depot station, all the way through hitching a ride along its five mile scenic steel rail system that carries passengers amongst the beauty of a theme park placed in the center of the Tennessee mountains. All aboard and welcome aboard the Dollywood Express. My name's Caleb and I'll be your conductor on the back of the train for this trip up the mountain. We'll be departing here in just a few moments. Thank you so much. Thank you. 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 Thank you.
Most of the equipment and systems used on the train are original and have plenty of historic value. This pays off for Smoky Mountain enthusiasts like us, wanting to get the full feel of the early railway days. whistle awakens your ears, and the smell of burning coal tickles your nose as you ride across Dollywood Express's iron and steel tracks, all while taking in the picturesque hidden sections of this carefully plotted mountain theme park. If you look off to your left above the tree line up there, you'll be able to see this portion of the Great Smoky Mountains National Park. You can understand why the Cherokee called them places of blue smoke. Well over a hundred years ago, there was over 1,200 farms that dotted the hills and hollers of these mountains. And in 1901, a little logging operation known as the Little River Logs of Texas came into the They logged these mountains up until there just about wasn't nothing left. But in 1934, President Franklin Delano Roosevelt established the Great Smoky Mountain National Park. Fast forward to present day, and we are the most visited national park in the United States. Well, as we roll on down the mountain here, folks, everybody keep all feet inside the cars at all times. Yeah, Dollywood, we're proud of all of our veterans from all branches of the military, and our thoughts and prayers go out to those on active duty today. Do have any veterans on the train with us today? Veterans, raise your hands, everyone. Let's give these folks a round of applause. Thank you for serving our country, and God bless each and every one of you. While the train engineer flawlessly guides the excursion throughout the mountainous foothills the park rests on, you're easily transported back into those earlier days when this was the choice method of travel for early tourists to the Great Smokies.
Finally arriving back at the train depot, it was good to be a part of Dollywood Express's daily burn of nearly two tons of coal that propel its commuters onward along its winding railway line each day. It was a pleasant trip that took a much needed load off for a moment during a busy day out in Pigeon Forge, having fun at the amusement park. To wave goodbye to the friendly train engineers and conductors, we were off again. Where? To wherever the road ahead would take us.